And between 2002 and 2012, the Ashford Yellow Jackets went 69 for 41, making six playoff appearances. But this decade, the stickers are self impaled. I mean, going 28 for 64, only seeing two 11 game seasons, both in 2013 and 2014. Robin Tyra is the third coach for the Yellow Jackets since the program had a winning season in 2014. We want to make you uncomfortable when you bring your butt to our place. That's what it will be. That was Tyra's expectations for last season before going 0-10, which goes down in Ashford history as the worst record in all of their 95 seasons. You went 2-8 and 0-10. And what makes this season different? Well, it's uh, the usual, you know, you finally get kids kind of worked in and a little bit more harmony and unity on offense, defense, just in the atmosphere in the locker room is a lot better. So uh, it's still got some growing to do, but I think the guys are in a better place from the standpoint of just where the direction and where we're, what the expectation is. Now, you may think, Austin, we've heard this record before, right? More times than the Frank Sinatra Christmas song. But what makes Coach Tyra's third year most important is that well, simply three times the charm. And the last time I checked, moving from 4A to 3A in Alabama football was a dramatic difference. And that might just have an effect on this year's season. Everybody's going to see that this region is going to be competitive. You know, but these, there's some teams in this region that's going to, I think, is going to turn heads. I Hopefully, we're going to be one of those that's going to do it as well, too. Robin says this uphill battle to turn this program around mainly starts with the team chemistry. <laughs> The hard thing of the last couple of years is just getting the locker room to be all together, a family atmosphere. And so it's, it's, I think, I feel like we're better there. We still have some finger point every now and then. That's one of the things we've got to, if we can finally get that completely out of the locker room, I think we're definitely in a better place. Everybody has got. Overall, this year's plan for the Yellow Jackets is to simply get on the map. Their first game will be at home versus their school rival Rehoboth on August 19th. We will have that game for you that night on the Extra Point Show.